The redhead cichlid have various names like the Quetzal cichlid, firehead cichlid or vieja. It is a moderately aggressive species. It may be possible to successfully keep this species in a community of other robust Central American cichlids if enough rock and driftwood is provided to form sufficient territories for all the fish and the aquarium is large enough. Let's take a look at some of the suitable tank mates for this fish. Welcome to Finding Fishes, let's get started. Jack Dempsey's are one of the most well-known cichlids. They are infamous for their aggression and don't play well with others, but that does not mean they can't be kept in groups or even with other species. Those who know how to handle their aggressive nature can create a thriving aquarium, but those that don't will struggle to stop them harassing their tank mates. When kept properly, this carnivorous fish introduces various colors and plenty of activity to your tank. Many people are put off by the aggressive nature of this species. Those not used to keeping aggressive fish might struggle to care for them properly, so they are not recommended for beginners. They spend a lot of time hiding away in these caves so can appear quite shy. Mostly they will stay in the middle and lower levels of the tank. They can be a good tank mate for redhead cichlid if taken care properly. The Texas cichlid is a member of the well-known cichlidae family, in good aquarium conditions they can live for up to 13 years. In addition to their impressive lifespan, they are also very big, growing up to 12 inches in length. They have become invasive species in multiple regions due to their dominant and aggressive temperament. This might be good for them, but it is extremely harmful for other fish in the same ecosystem. Unfortunately this behavior also transfers to the tank. However with the correct knowledge and care you will be able to look after them. Texas cichlid are extremely intelligent and appear to know their owners. They will push up to the front of the tank if they know it's feeding time, almost to interact with their owner. They can be an aggressive fish, but if handled well and their aggression kept in control then they can be a good option to be the tank made of redhead cichlid. The convict cichlid is one of the most popular members of the cichlidae family. It is an incredibly hardy fish, which is easy to care for, making it ideal for beginner fish keepers. Convict cichlid is an active fish that is known for its aggressive and territorial behavior. This behavior is common among many cichlids. If a fish encroaches on its territory, it will defend itself by chasing and harassing the other fish. They will spend most of their time near their territory inside caves and plant matter. Due to their wide natural habitat, they have learned to survive in a wide variety of water conditions, and because of this, they are very hardy fish. Their hardy nature, ease of care and vibrant colors make them ideal for a beginner. In addition they are also perfect for beginners looking to get into breeding fish. Who to their territorial nature it isn't recommended you place them with other species, but they can stand up for any aggression shown by red head and can be a tank mate for them. The green terror cichlid is a colorful freshwater fish which can bring interesting behaviors to your tank. It is a valuable and rewarding fish to add to your aquarium as they are relatively easy to keep as long as you provide good water quality. Despite this large fish being easy to care for, it can be aggressive, so it is best suited to more experienced aquarists. Because of its size, this fish can be extremely aggressive towards other fish especially during spawning seasons. With good care and good water quality this fish could live in your aquarium for 7 to 10 years. The green terror is a benthopelagic fish, which means that it will not stay within a certain depth range. Instead it will freely swim across the tank and look for food from the surface to the bottom part of the tank. This species of cichlid is very aggressive and territorial, females are often more aggressive than the males. The older the fish the more aggressive and territorial it becomes. They can be a good tank mate for redhead cichlid with big enough tank. The blood parrot cichlid is a member of the cichlidae family. This species has been bred as a hybrid of two other species. The parent species are unconfirmed, but speculation suggests mid oz and redhead cichlids might be the combination. You should treat the blood parrot as a Central American cichlid species, since both parent species come from this area. They are popular with cichlid enthusiasts, but it can be difficult to find one because of the controversy surrounding the species. Many people argue that the hybridization is unethical, so some stores refuse to sell them. You can keep them on their own, in groups, or in a community of suitable tank mates. They are generally a peaceful species, but they are easily stressed by aggressive fish, which may cause them to act out. They can be quite shy and will often hide among the plants and decorations. Most of their time is spent in the middle levels of the tank, however sometimes they will head lower down and start digging in search of food. 
they can be a ideal tank mate for redhead cichlid. Plecos are a group of armored catfish that belong to the Lyricoriidae family. They are by far the most popular catfish amongst fish keepers, and in total there are well over 150 species. The most in-demand member of this family is called the common pleco and can grow up to 24 inches long. The first thing to know about this fish is that it is nocturnal. This means during the daytime you won't see much activity. In the daytime, they can appear timid, and you will likely find them hiding amongst the plants and any caves inside your tank. When they are active you will notice that they are a bottom-dwelling fish and will move slowly across the floor of the aquarium. This fish is fairly peaceful and can be kept in a community tank. They can be a good tank mate for redhead cichlid. Oscar fish are an extremely popular freshwater fish in the aquarium community. They're beautiful and their mannerisms make them quite fun to watch. Oscars are infamous for their aggression, which is hard to imagine, since they swim so gracefully, but they prove that looks can be deceiving. These are temperamental creatures that should only be looked after by experienced fish keepers. As omnivores they're easy to feed, but it can be hard to find suitable tank mates. Oscars are territorial, so adding them to your tank can be risky. They aren't afraid to attack other fish and will do so if a fish encroaches on their territory. Mating and feeding times can also fuel their aggression. Most of their time will be spent swimming in the mid-levels of the tank, though they'll often head down to the substrate in search of food. If you can control the aggression of both Oscar and redhead cichlid then they can be a good tank mates. The silver dollar fish is a popular and unique freshwater fish that have been a staple inclusion in tanks for quite a while. They have a very interesting and appealing appearance, but that's not the only reason that makes them a great fish to own. Silver dollar fish care is a fairly simple process that won't take a ton of time or cause you a bunch of headaches. These fish are relatively low maintenance and will live for a long time if you hold up your end of the bargain. They're also great for community tanks. The list of possible silver dollar fish tank mates is quite long. These are top dwelling fish, which means they will spend most of their time in the upper half of your freshwater aquarium. Silver dollar fish are very pleasant fish to keep. They're calm, not aggressive, and fairly active. You'll almost never see them show any kind of aggression toward each other or other fish in your tank. This makes them a great community fish that you don't have to worry about. These fish are very friendly and will pose no threat or issue to be a tank mate for redhead cichlid. That's it for today guys, hope you really enjoyed the video, keep supporting us and stay tuned for more such interesting videos. Finding fishes remember the name.